the World Professional Snooker Trophy. Today, 50 years of age. It was bought, in fact, the first year that the championship was run, and that was in 1927 when the title was won by the great Joe Davis, who helped to pay for that trophy out of his winnings as champion in that year. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Rare Reed leads 24 frames to 18. Terry Monster Gray. And so we come to the frame that Redden is really looking for. But will the South African, who's broken off, keep him at bay? 24 frames to 18, then. Redden, who started life down the pits from Tredegar in Wales. And that could be enough, four oh, points away. Four, Perry doesn't mind, they all count. Well, of course, Six. a bit of luck like that always helps you when you've missed an easy shot, but it doesn't do your confidence much good because he did miss Seven. the red he went for. Um, so confidence wise, but here again, we're in the same position where his positional players let him down. He was well in amongst the reds there. Five or six reds open at the top of the pack. Yeah. And he's up. And he's red down just below the D. Oh, and he misses the pink. Surely nerves have not crept in at this critical stage of this 49 frame final. 42-14. at the scoreboard. Six. What a terrific long puzzle he is. Thirty five points in it. And again, the pink is missed. Redden still with a chance of pulling the frame out of the bag. Call with two reds and two blacks, plus the colours, there's a possible 43 on the table. What? Now he 
has the problem of this last red. has left not only a Chinese snooker, which is over the top of the black, but he's left it very difficult down the line. Had the South African a clear cue ball, he may be able to swerve around the pink and blue. But in these circumstances, he must go off the cushion. The bridge hand there, getting over the black, and he's way off the mark, four points All away. Four, we're in. And so the difference now is just 24 points. One. Right behind his favorite color, the black. points behind. That's there. He's now in position for these five colors. The dying moments now of the Embassy World Professional Snooker Championship for 1978 at the table, taking the last four balls, is a former champion on five occasions, Welshman Ray Redden. He's now just two points behind, requires both pink and black. True world champion style, Redden takes the final frame and dons the world crown. Well, I feel much better now, Jack. My. Oh, yeah. Six times? Yeah, well, you know. How does it feel? Yeah, Every you know. one is, is one, actually. Does the sixth feel better than the first? No, no. Everyone has got his own courage now, actually. And as the years go on, because of the adv advent of television and our sponsor, the game is getting bigger. And it gets harder to win, actually. So each one is individual, actually. First place, call upon John Spencer for a check for £500 for the highest break of the tournament, 138. And now 
to uh, that great fighter, a man who's fought his way through first for the first time to the final of the uh, Embassy World Professional Snooker Championship, the losing finalist, 3,500 pounds, Perry Mann. And now for the big one, the 1978 Embassy World Professional Snooker Champion, 7,500 pounds, a trophy, Ray Reardon. <laughs> 